so we have lots more regulation and banks are making lots more profit. That's what the people who wanted the regulation brought in in the first place would say should be the outcome and is the outcome. Why is this confusing? Well, you know, banks complain a lot about this stuff uh, not just hampering profits but hampering lending and uh, you know and, and capital markets that people aren't able to access credit uh, but those numbers have been improving as well so things have been getting better and better in the last couple of years so therefore does this then put the kibosh on the argument that those make that want less regulation well, in some ways, yes. Of course, some people will take it that way, and then the other people say, "Wait, wait, wait, wait. We're not really, you know, it's not the same thing." And and you know, I do quote some um, banking lobbyists who explain that, you know, the economy was much smaller nominally. The economy is much bigger ten years later, and and thus it's not one-to-one -one comparison. And also, that you know, there one of the things we have to always pay attention, and investors look at this a lot, is return on equity. That's much lower. It's less than half. You know, they used to have twenty. Uh, percent return on equity that the big banks um, and now it's below 10 so that's that's a very low number that's partly because the regulations they you know the the profit number might be huge maybe just as much but when you have more equity more capital which is the biggest top part of the regulation the international rules and the US gold plating them then your return on that capital is lower What's the quality of this profit in terms of safety? So is it safer profit if there is such a thing? So is it being made in a way that's less risky to the average consumer? Well, this past quarter was was pretty good because lending was up and 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 profit and uh, uh, loan margins in other words their interest uh, income margins were up. So it was much safer mm -hmm. because trading was down. It was it was a quarter with lower trading. But if you look at longer picture, bigger picture, the longer time period, the last four or five quarters, actually trading has been going up and up and up. Even in firms like Morgan Stanley, yes. where it was supposed to change and the, and the new paradigm was going to be safe things and we're not going to really be big traders, they've been trading big too. So the, the not so safe, well, I mean, it could be safe, but we don't know as much about mm -hmm. part of banking, which is the, the trading, the markets, um, uh, and, and the band prop trading part, which we never will know whether it, it's, it's still in there. Those things have, have also been doing well, too. So, you know, but there are so many things that, that regulations have brought in that make it safer. Even with all this activity coming back, you would hope that when there's trouble, there are enough backstops to prevent.